Hey, what's going on guys? Let's look at this problem right here. Here this question is asking a new software package is expected to improve productivity of AIM manufacturing if the company has to pay $1000 at the end of every four, fourth year for subscription fee then find out the total cost after 20 years with 4% per, interest compounded yearly. Now let's see how to do that. Here I'm going to use three different methods to calculate this one. Let's look at the first method. The first method, let's put the year here, year and then future value, future value and then calculation. Okay, year four. So every four year we have thousand times since this future F or P and four percentage interest rate and uh, so we are going to have 20 years right so 20 minus 4 that's going to be 16 and if you look at this value in the table thousand times this value is 1.8729 and that's equal to 1873 and then every four years so second one is eight year thousand f of P for percentage 20 minus 8 that's 12 and if you look at this value on the table you will see that is 1.6010 that is 1601 now the next thing is 12 thousand F over P for percentage 20 minus 12 that's 8 and then here thousand and if you look at this value on the table that is 1.3685 and that's equal to 1369 <coughs> now the next thing is 16th year 1000 f over p 4 percentage 20 minus 16 that is 4 and 1000 times this value if you look at this value on the table that is 1.1698 that is 1170 and then 20 years we have 1000 there will be 4 4 minus I mean 20 minus 20 that's 0 so we don't have to put this one and that's going to remain 1000 and here 1000 let's add, add them all together and you will get 7030 7, here the question is asking if the company has to pay thousand at the end of four, four year subscription fee then find out the total cost after 20 years with four percentage interest converted yearly this is the value this is the this is the cost total cost after 20 years <coughs> okay now there are many different ways we can do this actually three method i'm going to do it right here let's look at the second method the second method is we use this equation f is equal to p that is thousand initial one and uh, thousand times f over a future value and here we have to calculate the interest rate to calculate the interest rate this is the formula i put it right here i efficiency is equal to one plus since the interest rate is four, four percentage 0 0.04 power 4 percentage minus 1 and if you calculate you will get 16 point this is for every fourth year right that's 4 and this is for 4 percentage 0 0.04 and uh, if you calculate this one you will get 16.99 percentage and that's the value you have to put right here 16.99 and 16.99 um, four times five five times we are going to have because 20 is totally so 444 four, four, we have we are going to have five times so if you look at this value in the table you will see that is 7.013 and that's equal to 7013 dollar and that is the f value now this is method one method one and this one is method two Now let's look at the third method.
third method is a little bit different here here what we have to do is first we have to calculate a so method 3 right here method 3 first we have to calculate a to calculate a this is the formula a is a principal amount that's 1000 times a over f 4 percentage every 4 year and uh, if you calculate this value if you look at this one in the table that's 0 0.23549 and this value gives us 235.49 now we are interested in finding f f is equal to a times a is 235.49 times f over a 4 percentage for 20 years and if you look at this value 235.49 and if you look at the value in the table that is 29.777 and when you multiply you will get 7012 so from these three methods we are getting same answer a little bit different but it's almost same okay that's how we do this kind of problems i hope you guys find this video helpful thanks for watching and if you are trying to learn engineering economics there are a bunch of videos in my playlist i hope you guys watch that too and don't forget to subscribe see you next time